Hi, this is Dr. Centeno, and today we're going to talk about why a shoulder decompression surgery, otherwise known as an acromioplasty, is often a bad idea for patients. So, what is the AC joint? It's right up top there where the arrow is, it's where the collarbone meets the back of the shoulder blade. And when the joint develops arthritis or is a little misshapen, the concept is it can place pressure on the rotator cuff. And when that doesn't get better with physical therapy, often surgical decompression or an acromioplasty is performed. This means that you cut off the end of the collarbone and remove important stabilizing ligaments. So is this a good idea? Well, what does the research say? Interestingly, it's not positive for acromioplasty. Basically, adding this procedure to a routine rotator cuff repair doesn't help patients in this large randomized controlled trial. In addition to that, removing this thing, the AC joint, can make forces on the rotator cuff worse, which is bizarre because the whole purpose of the surgery is to try to make them better. So let's see what really happens in a patient who was made worse by this procedure. This is the AC joint. I've drawn it in there uh, because it doesn't exist as you'll see here. But you got the collarbone off to the right, the extension of the shoulder blade off to the left. And after the joint is lopped off by the surgeon, this is what it looks like. There's a huge gap there where, the, where a joint should be. Now that gap is going to cause some issues in this video I'll show you. So this is when the patient has his shoulder down and you can see the gap, the huge gap is about three boxes long. And when the shoulder goes up, this gap closes to uh, under two boxes long. Now that's a problem because it means that this shoulder is now grossly unstable as a result of the surgery. So here's what it looks like as the patient moves. So we can see here the patient moving up and that gap closes and then the gap opens. Every time this is happening, the shoulder is getting beat up by this lack of stability because of this surgical removal of that joint. So in conclusion, removing the AC joint is not a good idea. The research doesn't say that it helps, so it's bizarre that it's still being done routinely. The research shows that it makes forces on the rotator cuff worse and not better. And you can see with your own eyes the shoulder becomes unstable. So consider more advanced regenerative medicine solutions like precise PRP injections or stem cell injections rather than this kind of surgery, which is going to change your biomechanics irreversibly forever. Thanks so much for watching. And for more info, go to Regenix.com.